Hey guys, welcome to Solution Landscape and Pressure Washing Channel. I will be showing you today how to make a quick connect soft wash gun. Um, you could just get it, you could get the parts right from uh, Home Depot, Lowe's, Agri Supplies, um, all those little places. You could just put it in together and make it a quick connect. I have seen a couple of videos of um, all the pressure washers and YouTube just putting guns together. And I've been trying to put a gun together in a way that it was just a quick connect in and out um, with a ball valve. Uh, some people have it in their channel, but kind of they, I didn't see that they explained it really well, how to put it together, what kind of parts to get. So I will be doing that in a bit. All right. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, this is the soft wash gun I've been using right now. As you can see, it's made out of uh, PVC with a ball valve and my quick connect on the top for my J-Rod. But I wanted something where I could leave this quick connect right on the holes. I dragged my holes all the way from my trailer out there. Uh, that's my pressure washing trailer with my um, pressure washing vehicle in the front, my landscaping truck for my guys over here with my landscaping trailer right over here. Uh, we are just full service um like i was saying i have a couple of you know um like you could get this for the irrigation system a couple of little pipes to be able to make um how you call it like an extender for the gilmore going and i have a schedule 80 half an inch ball valve with a half an inch um uh, pipe adapter in it um we got a half an inch to half an inch uh, connector half an inch quick connect for the ball valve right here then uh, this uh, nipple is the one that's going to be going right over here to be able to connect and disconnect from there and for the Gilmore going I have a three fourths to half an inch uh, adapter which is going to go just like that and then it's going to go just like that to be able to connect in and out from the ball valve. And this one's right here is to be able to kind of like a, like come, like a little extended up to be able to reach high places. Since you could watch with the Gilmore going or you could just come back and add on little, little pipes like this to be able to connect it to your quick connect and i do have my j-rod i don't have it right here in front of me but i will be tr giving this a try i've been seeing a lot of people using this i don't know how good it is but i will be giving it a try all right see you guys back in a bit all right once everything is done also i will not be putting teflon tape in none of my connectors at all i will be using the true blue which is like vibration resistant so I heard from a lot of people that this is very, very good to be able to avoid any leaks or anything like that. Uh, Teflon tape with SH, with SH, the way we use it in a soft wash system, is very strong for it. So see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, welcome back. Um, I was already able to put everything together. Um, like I showed you earlier, this was my gun. For my soft wash system before i had a three quarters to half an inch straight to the holes right over here which i couldn't uh you know take it out out of my holes or anything it was always dragging on the floor or anything like that so i was able to make this improvement let me show you i would put i was able to put a schedule 80 ball valve here chemical um Chemical resistant, just on and off, on and off. Half an inch quick connect, straight to the holes with another half an inch uh, male to the holes. Straight as you can see right there. Then uh, let's say I wanna be able to use my wand with my J-Rod, right? So I could just come 
and connect it right there. And up here, connect my J-Rod or connect um, this uh, soap supplier right up here. That's it, and everything is right there, as you can see. Excuse my landscaping trailer back there, man. This is a pressure washing thing right now. But um, yeah, I'm done soap washing the house. Take it out from here, that's it. Or uh, let's say I wanna be able to use my gear more going right over here. See, quick connect, I was able to use, uh, what did I use? Uh, three four um mail to half an inch mail adapter to be able to adapt my quick connect nipple same way connect it right there you could use it all day gone all day long i'm sorry and if you need like a, an extra push like um how you call it um like to be able to reach a little bit higher then I make this little piece. This is a three fourth uh, female to a half an inch female, half an inch pipe, half an inch to half an inch adapter, half an inch to one fourth um, adapter, and then my quick connect. All I gotta do is just Tie it up right there. Hold on, let me take this one off out of here. Oh, you ain't going anywhere. There. And that's it, just to reach a little bit higher. And if you don't need this, what you gotta do is just, ooh, still wet. That true blue thing is very, very good. Or you could use this straight from here. You could just wash your house straight from here. Oh, let me get a napkin. Done washing the house. Disconnect and just drag it to your trailer, man. That's it. And you don't get no simple than this. Yeah, you know, I started just like everybody else, man. Small, and then kept walking myself up. I'm not big, I'm still small, but hey, I'm making money. And I'm improving myself as months and years go by. You never stop learning, you always learn every day something new, you know? So I've been trying to make it easier. I saw a couple of videos here and there. Um, people already had it set up, but they never actually details plain that I find. I don't know if they're still out there or anything, but um, I'm just making this one to be able to help out people like you that maybe are starting out and just want to be able to have it in a way that is easier for you, you know? But, yep, there, half an inch quick connect. Remember, you want half an inch to three, uh, three fourth on your pipe and your, your connectors. The reason why, if you go any lower, then what you're going to do is just restrict flow. And I'm in a 12-bowl system, um, 7 gallons per minute. I'm not in a bigger than that. I'm still doing houses with 12 volts. Sometimes I downstream houses at the same time, but hey, it works for me. I'm done in a house with a house like all the pants. Single-story house, maybe like 40 minutes. Uh, Two-story house rings and everything done hoses already roll up into the trailer trailer doors closed that will be like an hour and 20 an hour 25 and then i knock on the customer's door we walk the house and just you know to the next job all right guys um this is actually my first video making for the youtube channel with the pressure washing of how to help people out there uh, i got a lot of improvement on my trailer uh, like I said, I started very small and now I'm in a bigger trailer and I will be posting more videos on how I did things on, on my end from becoming from a 8 times 4 trailer to a 10 by 5, 10 by 6 trailer. 
an enclosed trailer. So, and I started also from the back of my truck too, washing houses. So, you know, you never stop learning, okay? See you guys, don't forget to subscribe for more videos. Hit the like button and just hit that little bell right on top. So when I post a video, you get the notification, you could be able to see it. All right, man, thank you. Have a great one, guys. Bye.